Hold on. <laughs> that, that, that's a good question because I don't, I mean, I've got so many stories that I could, I could go off of. Uh, I, there was one time when I was coming home from Arizona and uh, I, I was loaded up. I'd been down there all winter and uh, I stopped and fueled up one place and when I was getting on the freeway, I seen this, I seen this old van and I seen a bunch of little kids and, and a guy up under the hood working on his van and, and uh, it was hot. And I just, you know, I was like, what would my dad do right here, you know? So I pulled over and I went and talked to this guy and he says he was on his way taking his family to Texas from California. And he said, man, I run out of money and he says, I'm trying to get this van fixed. He says, I, I gotta be at my new job tomorrow. And, and uh, he had zip ties and plastic this and plastic that <laughs> trying to fix this van. And uh, I, had, uh, I had about $300, $300 and some change in cash. And uh, I says, he could use it a lot more than me. And he wanted my, my address and uh, so he could send me the money. And I says, no. I says, you don't worry about it. I says, you help somebody else out that might need it in the future. And uh, that, uh, you know, that, that made me feel better than, than anything right there. And that's the kind of stuff that my dad taught me growing up. I remember he was always always helping people and and always trying to help people in the in the right path and and uh, my whole time growing up my dad you know always taught me you know to do things right uh, he told me you know uh, as long as you do the right thing everything will be all right and, and fall into place he was just a good example to me growing up and uh, to me giving feels way better than receiving so that's how I try to live my life now these days I've I've got a couple of kids. They're you know, I've got a little girl and she's two and uh, a little boy that's four. And today's world is a whole different world than my dad grew up in and, and that I grew up in and you know, I feel like a lot of times respect goes out the door and, and stuff like that. But from the things I've learned from my father, um, I really try to get my kids to to keep that respect and and just really lead a, a good path because of what my dad's uh, taught me. Um, anything from uh, holding doors to saying please and thank you and, and little things and, and helping others. And um, you know, I'm only four years into this and it's a bigger challenge than, than I had thought it was gonna be, but uh, I enjoy it. I love being a father and I wouldn't change it for anything.